and I was so hesitant to try this thing guys honestly I was so hesitant to try it Fenty I can see what you're doing you're coming for the bags with blood in your eyes Rihanna what's up guys welcome back to my channel this is your girl IJ if this is your first time being here you're welcome to this video and if you're a returning subscriber thank you so very much for stopping by for another video so in this video we are going to be reviewing the Fenty Beauty powder foundations this just came out like in December so I'm excited to try I think December or November in December I think so so I'm excited to try this if you know me you know I love every anything Fenty so I'm excited to try this powder foundations I went ahead and did my eyebrow and my eye my eyeshadow at once just so that we can get that out of the way and concentrate just on this powder foundation so I decided to pick two shades for this powder foundation just because just in case something doesn't go well but you know I always like to when I buy foundations I always like to go with two shades a shade that is a little bit lighter and a shade that's maybe a little bit darker you know just any in case it doesn't work then I can mix the two so according to um, Fenty whatever shade you are in the foundation that is the same shade you are in the powder foundation so if say your shade is 385 or 380 or 370 or 3 whatever then your shade for the powder foundations it's that number so if you're 385 then your shade is 385 so i did pick up 385 and i also picked up 390 just in case you know if it doesn't match or something so that's what i have here so if you want to see what my thoughts are about this foundation let's jump into this video and i'll let you know we are going to first of all start by priming our face and i'm going to use the fenty beauty pro filter um primer instant as a pro filter it's actually pro filter instant with touch primer so i'm going to use that to prime my face just so that we have a good base when you're using a powder foundation you want to make sure you have a good base because you need something for that powder to stick on so it's good to start with a good base so for the simple reason that powder foundations does not conceal i'm just going to conceal my under eyes just so that i have that coverage that i normally desire underneath my eyes and i'm going to use the fenty beauty um pro filter instant with touch concealer in the shade 370 and i'm just going to highlight my face my on my under eyes just where i normally highlight So I'm just going to quickly blend this way in the walls my beauty blender. Where were you? And also the main reason why I'm using this concealer before using the foundation is just because when you're using a powder foundation or anything that's powder, you cannot put anything that is wet or like a concealer uh, like a concealer over it because it's just going to mess up the whole the whole chemical process of it i call it chemical process because i don't know what else to use it's just going to mess up everything so if you're using a powder product it's best to use anything that is um maybe watery in the form of maybe concealer or whatever or maybe a highlighter or maybe using a blush that is wet it's good to use that before you actually apply the powder product i hope that makes sense Alright, so this is a moment of truth. Let's see how this powder foundation is going to work. So it comes in a pack like this. That's a typical Fenty pack. And um, it just says on the Fenty Beauty by Rihanna Pro Filter Soft Matte um, Powder Foundation. And um, once you open it, you have this in here. This is very typical of Fenty and I'm using the shade 8385. Um, that is the shade I normally use for my powder for my normal um, foundation 
that is the powder foundation right there it looks more like my shade and it comes with this pad which I normally do not use so we are going to try this with this brush right here this is a, a foundation brush so I'm just going to pick up the shade and see what happens I think that looks more like my shade okay do you see any difference it's giving me a little bit of coverage which I do like for a powder foundation that is good and I'm just trying to stamp it in just so that wow that looks nice oh okay I'm just going to add over need on the need or over need whatever it is I like it I like this wow okay all right Fenty I see you hmm fine I love wow are you guys see what I'm seeing hey <laughs> all right now all right now so you guys see what i meant by if you're using anything that is cream and you want to use a powder foundation or maybe a powder something it is best to go first with the cream product before you put in your powder product because when you do that you don't change or affect anything about the product i love this i think this is the best brush for it actually wow are you guys seeing the amount of coverage that this has given me just being a powder foundation like it's really really nice it's really really nice guys honestly i don't know if you guys are seeing it it's given me a good amount of coverage so if you're one of those people who don't like foundations this is definitely something that you want to try trust me you can see how that covers like ah, 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 ah. hmm hmm wow Fenty I can see what you're doing you're coming for the bags with blood in your eyes Rihanna whoa 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 It looks like I apply foundation honestly it looks like I apply foundation it's not giving me full 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 coverage but it's giving me coverage which is really good for a powder foundation this is very good and I was so hesitant to try this thing guys honestly I was so hesitant to try it I was like just too many products we are buying here from safe what is it for so I was like you know what let me try it so for some of us nurses who go to work for some of us who go to work this will be a good let me try this brush right here and see i think this one will not give me so much coverage i'm just trying to blend those two parts just so that everything looks nice and seamless wow look at me look at me Woo! i love this i love this i can use this normally when i'm going when i when i'm going to work i don't apply any makeup so i can definitely put this on and be fine because i put on mask every minute every second i don't want foundation to be all over the place so this powder foundation would definitely be a good deal I love this oh my god so if you're on my skin shade I use 385 and let me show you guys how 390 looks like 390 is a little bit darker I love this I love this oh my god 390 this is 390 it's a little bit darker than my shade let me put them side by side just so you guys see if there's any difference here so this 390 they almost look the same so I can even use the 390 and it should be good 
this is 390 right here and this is 385 so i can actually use both shades and it should be good beautiful and i think this brush right here was the best so it's a dense um this is a foundation brush and this is a flat top foundation brush so if you want to try it maybe you can get a brush like this if you do not have one look at my forehead ah hmm so i'm just going to contour bones and put on everything then we'll come back with the final thoughts just so you guys know already know anyway right, so here we go with the final look i hope you guys did like this video i love my face i love this foundation powder foundation whatever thing you want to call it i love it honestly like this looks amazing look at my face look at can you tell the difference between this and when i use normal foundation or regular foundation no 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 you can't this is beautiful I just love this I can't stop looking at my face look at my face guys like tell me am I the only one tripping here Wow Wow that's all I have to say Wow so you can tell for yourself you can tell for yourself I cannot just make this up you guys saw this you saw it I cannot make this up let me know what your thoughts are have you tried this before do you like it if you don't can you tell me why can you tell me why you don't like it give me just one reason why you don't like it and if you love it please let me know as well if you haven't tried this and you plan to try it let me know if you're going to try it so this will be great for those of us who love to put on makeup like to work or you know to work especially because you don't want anything heavy on your face this will be great because all you need to do is get up in the morning slap your face with some of this and you're gone you're out of the door you don't have to deal with any blending or foundation and all of that jazz you don't have to do that this will give you a good coverage maybe for those who have like hyperpigmentation so maybe some hard dark spots on your face you can just conceal with some concealer you know dark spot conceal with some concealers and put this right on top and you'll be flawless medium to full. it says medium to full coverage light as air and it does feel light i don't feel like i have anything on my face flawless filter effect flawless filter effect you can see for yourself now i don't even have to explain this then it says no this one is german some other language right there let me see what the computer says about this is it buildable so new pro filter soft matte powder foundation it's buildable it's light to full coverage for all it's long wear, light as a crease resistant. But let's see if it does transfer though. Let me see if it transfers. Because I don't know how this will work like when you put on a mask. But just a little bit. This will be great for your mask. Uh, now we wear mask. Mask has become our regular life, whatever. We, and it's going to be time saving, honestly, because then you don't have to. You know, like when you put on foundation, you have to blend and blend and blend. But this, you just dump on your face and you go. So it's definitely time saving. You don't have to do much. It gives you almost a full coverage. My face looks flawless. No dark spots on my face. Nothing. This is a keeper. I'm definitely going to be using it. Definitely going to be using it to work. So if you see me tomorrow at work, my face looks like this. Do not even ask me a question. Just know it's Fenty Beauty. Pro filter, instant Fenty Beauty powder foundation. Yep. Let me know what your thoughts are. You saw the application. Let me know, guys. Say something. Let me know down in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching this video. I'll talk to you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.